So Nostalgia is a new film by Blecker Studios, and it's a story starring John Hamm, Catherine Keener, and Bruce Stern. And right off the bat, the movie is really about completely what the title is about. It's about nostalgia. The film surrounds characters, not only John Hamm, Bruce Stern, and Katherine Keener, but many characters who have either suffered a loss, who are living without a family member, they've gone through a divorce, or what have you, where they're missing somebody from their past. And so the whole film is about these characters coming together, not only through each other's misery, but also several items that remind them of the people they love most. And guys, what I can say about nostalgia is it has got to be the most disappointing film I've seen in a long time. The movie had all kinds of potential of uh, releasing a great and powerful story about giving getting over your past and becoming a better version of yourself and of course we got an all-star cast who doesn't love Bruce Dern or John Hamm or Katherine Keener for goodness sakes. But this movie, man what a mess. And when I say mess, I mean nothing really happens in this movie. You have these characters who on the surface they could be intriguing and every actor in the film does a fine job. I can't say the actors give bad performances because they really don't. But the characters are really bland and the story is just bland as well along with the pacing Th this whole movie just doesn't really go anywhere at a certain point while i was watching this film i had to check my watch like four or five different times i mean and there was a point about halfway through where i almost felt like i was falling asleep this film had the potential of giving a powerful message about how you can get over a family member's deaths or getting over divorces or getting over family members and over your miseries. But it didn't. This movie was a boring slog. There wasn't really any redeemable qualities that I can see. And like I said, I just kept f almost falling asleep the entire time I was watching it. Guys, I'm sorry I had to do this to you. I haven't given this rating in a long time. But at the end of the day, I still gotta say, nostalgia, stay in your shorts. Now before we leave off, I want to give you guys something positive and inspirational to go off of because the reason why I am able to give you this review is because of somebody named John from Sandwich John Films. If you guys don't know what Sandwich John Films is, it's a fan, not only a fantastic YouTube channel, it's also a fantastic site where you not only have the capability of winning screeners and being able to see movies early, but it's also a site that has high quality reviews reviews and high quality information on the latest movies in movie theaters and movies that are going to be coming down the road and trust me guys this is something that you need to check out it's completely and utterly worth your time and if you're lazy sometimes like I am and you don't want to go searching the internet don't worry there are a couple links not only to John's YouTube channel but also to the sandwich John films website so guys do yourself a favor and go check that out and of course you know what I'm gonna say next as always guys it is what you say that matters so have you had a chance to see nostalgia and what did you think of it more importantly Importantly, what is the most boring film that you've ever seen? Whatever your comment may be, leave it down below so we can get a conversation started. And if you like what you've seen here and you want to see more, click right there and subscribe and become part of the fray of nerds who love cinema. You all have a fantastic day.